Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I am using a face cam and doing something a little different so things might be a little weird because I'm not used to it. And now I have to look at you and not my world. It's a little different. So today I have a story that happened a while ago. Also, before I go into my story, I'm building a Seasons home, which, uh, ah! Seasons is out. That's my initial reaction, a little more. So I have this light and I feel like I look disgusting of how the it's reflecting on my glistening face because I'm just oh, I'm popping <laughs> I don't use that word so uh I'm not sp not sponsored but uh I have this wonderful stuff oh wow it focuses this camera focuses oh uh, lovely so I uh, bell bell I think that's his bell I think that's his bell Bell Vi Lemon Spark Lime Sparkling Water. And uh I don't know if it's backwards. I hope it's not backwards because it doesn't look backwards on my recording. But here I have my sparkling water, which I will be drinking throughout this video because it's a long one. <laughs> okay, so let's while you watch my build, listen to me, my face, and my story. So I recently went to Cedar Point. Now I'm over this now, but it took me longer than things usually do for me to get over. And uh, I went to Cedar Point um, with my friends. And so I was just, you know, hanging out. We were walking around. We rode rides, you know. I rode, and I'll, since it's so long, I'll talk about my journey of the roller coasters. Um, so first we got there. And my friend has platinum passes, and he took us, so we got to get in there earlier. And so, I don't know how that works. Hopefully it's not against the rules. I don't think it is. And so we got in there, and, like, they're all right. Like, I agreed to this. Like, I'm not a roller coaster person, and not a fan of them. <laughs> and so I was like, okay, I'm going to ride a roller coaster. We're all good. And so they were like... We always have to steal, like, if they ride 20 antique cars with me, then we'll ride whatever, I'll ride whatever crazy ride they want me to ride. And so, they take me, they take me there, and they're like, and this time I'm like, you know, it's silly. They wanted to ride Millennium, okay? And I was like, I was like, alright, I'll do it. That's fine. I'm completely fine with riding Millennium. And so I agreed myself to riding this roller coaster. I'm like, well, Canada, I can see Canada, and that's like an important deal to me. If you like didn't understand, but you can see Canada from Millennium. And uh, so I was like, uh, excuse me, Canada, mine. I want to see it. <laughs> I keep doing that. I'm sorry. And so I'm like, all right, Canada, let's do it. I'm good. Also, what I'm doing here in the video, so don't ignore that, because at first I was like, oh, make some, like, storage basement room. I didn't. And I deleted the whole thing. And I was like, oh, it'll just be a bathroom and, like, a thing. No. Gone. Snatched. <laughs> so, I wrote Millennium. I got there. I walked up to the thing. I walked in line. I'm like, ooh, I'm really doing this. I'm in the line. I'm walking around. And so I got up to the thing, and I'm like, oh, my gosh. I'm really gonna ride this roller coaster. Like, that's, that's what's happening. It's happening right now. And so I hopped in the roller coaster. I've like got in line. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm waiting to ride this ride. I'm like, I don't want to ride front row. Like, there was this long line, and my friend was like, oh, you could ride front row with me. And I'm like, um, let me work up to front row on Millennium. Doesn't sound that fun. And so. And my friend wasn't there yet, so I would have easily rode into her with her. But I rode I rode with my other friends and he was like he was he was like, Whew, this is a little nerve wracking. I've rode this before, but like, I don't know. And I'm like Okay. You're freaking out and like I'm internally dying. And so we're I'm saying they're like Oh my gosh, I'm gonna ride a roller coaster that's like real tall, 90 miles per hour, like 
not even really thinking what I'm doing. And so, I get in line. It's our turn. I hop in the car. I hop in, like, the track car thing. And I hop in, and I'm like, oh my gosh. We start going up the hill, and I'm like, what am I doing on here? Like, I need to get off. And, like, my friend's like, oh, it's okay. Blah, 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 blah. And he's he's the kid that I talked about, um, Aiden. I'm sure I've said his name before. And I've talked about him. He plays the sense and all that. So I've talked about him in my videos before. Just you we're sitting we're sitting I'm sitting in their car and he's like, Ooh, this is gonna be fun and I'm like, When can I see Canada? That's like a half the reason why I'm on this roller coaster. Let me see Canada right now. We go up the hill, there's Canada, and then my friend from the front row is like, Hey Mac, we're gonna drop and I'm like we're going down! We're going down! Oh, please! We're going down! And I go, we, we go, we, and I'm like, ah, and I'm like almost passing out the whole time. It's like, re, re, and I'm like, oh, please, oh, like, and I'm sitting there in the ride photo. I'm like all the way back, like, and like, <laughs> it was. Roller coasters are my thing, and it's getting my heart pumping even talking about it. I don't, I didn't like it. But then, uh, the reason why I'm telling this story, some, like, we, a little more, a little later on, we ride, I ride Maverick, and, like, I was okay with that, and I loved it. My favorite ride in Cedar Point. You can judge me. I don't care. And so, the... We got there. I rode that. That was great. Um, I didn't like the tunnel stop thing, but that's that's okay because I liked everything else about the ride. Anyway, we are we stopped riding roller coasters. I rode Raptor and Gatekeeper. I love Gatekeeper. I forget if Gatekeeper or Maverick is my favorite, but I like both of them, and I know it's different. Gatekeeper goes through the keyhole, and so I rode those, and you know. Love them. They're my favorites. I guess I like loop-de-loops. I was avoiding loop-de-loops, and I guess I like loop-de-loops. And so, I ride, I ride all those rides. We come back after we ride Raptor, and I'm like, and I'm like, sitting there, and like, I didn't really drink water much, and I wanted to, just like, my friend's dad wanted to go to like, all the roller coasters and ride them. And he was probably more focused on the roller coasters than actually me, and that's, that's okay. And so, we were riding all the rides, and I'm like, okay. Like, they stop at Blue Streak and some other ride. I forget what it was called. And I'm laying there on this, like, post thing, and I'm, like, sitting there on the, like, mm, like, dead, wiped, done, done. I didn't sleep much that night either. <laughs> so, yeah. So I get, I'm, I'm on the thing. And Raptor, who I did not like Raptor, and judge me about that because people like that one too. Didn't like, it. and so I'm um, like that thing screels and screeches, and everyone just like wanted to sit there, and I'm like they're like dying of the noise mostly. Awful, <laughs> the noise was awful, and didn't like it, and so we leave. But you want to guess where we went? We went around, back around to an outside, right next to the track. Like, even closer than I was before. And that was close. Like, the thing was swooshing and hitting me almost. Like, we're up against a fence. And we're eating. And so, we're eating. We eat. Num num. I'm hydrated. I'm feeling good. Like, what am I going to ride next? And, uh, well, I didn't ride anything next. Because I, um... I'm fine with it, and I, uh, kind of, I asked my friend, his grandma, if I could use the restroom. Now, we don't, she's, she's okay. She's fine. She probably accidentally forgot that she said that I could use the restroom or something. Anyway, I asked her to use the restroom. <laughs> we walk on, we walk on out, and... I walk onto the bathroom. Since I have long hair, I'm like, which way is it? And she uh, points to the woman's restroom. Didn't notice it was a woman's restroom till I got all the way over there. And it was far. It was a far walk. And I get all the way over there and I'm like, 
this is the woman's restroom. Maybe the men's is on the other side of it. And it's like one of those two, like, here, there's a wall, there's a wall, and it kind of just goes, one goes in and the other goes in. It wasn't, and I had to walk. It was like, there was like a sign, like, restroom on the other side of the building. So I'm not the only one who probably mistaked that the boys' restroom was on the other side. And so I go all the way around the building, use restroom, come out. And I start walking, and I'm like, wait. Where is everyone? Like, I'm walking towards the place where we were eating. I'm like, where'd everyone go? So I get closer. I'm like, maybe I don't see them. Maybe they went to a different table farther away or something. I get closer. No one's there. At all. Okay. I'm sorry. Um, my dad came down. That's alright, though. Because mistakes happen. And so I made a mistake. So they were all gone. And I was like, um, okay, like, trying not to freak out, because, like, they were gone. It's kind of like a thing, you just don't disappear, and then you're like, oh, well, I guess everyone's gone. Gonna ride all these roller coaster rides by myself, which my friend has done. Confusing? Okay, he's like, yeah, I'll find them later. I'm like... For me, I was like, um, um, I need to find someone, like, something's gotta happen, I gotta go over here, I gotta go over there, <laughs> and so, I was sitting there like, um, what do I do, and then I'm like, let's wait here for a second, probably come back, waited there for a few minutes, walked around a bit, and then I was like, alright, nothing's gonna happen. And I'm like, all right. So, what am I gonna do? And so I get, I get there, and I'm like, all right, gotta do something. Something's gotta happen. So I start. Thank, thank goodness, one of my other friends, I disappeared from the group. But and my friend, Aiden, mentioned, well, I hope he knows where the lost and found is. And I was like, there's a lost and found. And he told me where it was, which is at the front of the park. So I was like, all right, Aiden said earlier, there's a lost and frowned at the front of the park. That's where I'll go right now. So I started walking, do to do to do to do. I walk, I walk all the way there. I get there, which is pretty far from Raptor, honestly. Excuse me, I keep burping. It's this wonderful bell of love. Ow! Not ow, I mean, why? Just spilled it on me. Whoopsie doozles. And so, I make it all the way to there. And then the. Open the door. And for a while, I stood out the door like, Are they coming? Are they following me? Like, are they actually waiting for me here? And I'm like, they're not here. So I walk in, I open the door, I walk inside. And some lady in the front desk who was super nice and super kind. And she goes, sir, anything I can do for you? And I was like, yeah, I kind of got a little separated from my group. And she's like, oh, okay, so are you with a, a class or just a group of people? And I'm like, just a group of people. And she's like, you, who are you here with? And I'm like, my friends just got a little separated. I'm sure it's no big deal. Well, I never said it's no big deal, but it wasn't a big deal. And so I'm like, I'm just a little separated. We, we okay? I'm okay. Just like to get back and know where they are. And so she's like, well, do you have a number you could call? And I was like, I have one. <laughs> Because I know my mom's number, but that phone normally stays here. So she doesn't often have it. And if she was to answer, most of the time she just gets junkos on it. So she doesn't really even answer it. So I go, yeah, she might an might not answer, but she might. Well, she might. So just going to, I don't know, what do we want to do? Can we track down the number of my um, mm, friend's Platinum pass, do they call his mom? Like, what's possible, what isn't possible? And so, we call my mom. 
and I call him like, hey, kind of lost and found. He got a little separated from the group, just like a little teary, like trying not to ball my eyes out. And so she's, and then she doesn't answer. I'm like, all right. So what do we do? And then she's like, um, let's see how big the group is. And then we're like, all right, we're looking for. I'm like, I don't know, let's count them, mm-hmm, <laughs> yeah, Aiden, Grandma, let's count all this, and we count everyone, and then we're like, alright, there's 14 people, 15 people, 14 or 13 people, 14 including me, I believe, so there'll probably be 13 people walking around without someone, and so, they're like, okay, that's a big group, and they've probably split up into groups, and we're like, I'm like, okay, we got this, we got that, we got that. We're good. We're good. We can figure this out. So, more people come in. She's like, just sit down. Wait a little bit. I'll get you a chair. I'm like, no, there's a chair right here. I sit down. And I'm waiting. And more people are coming in. Guy looking for glasses. Someone looking for their phone. We're not looking for the phone, but from another place, like, I just lost my phone. Um, there's online protocol to follow when I go back home. And I'm like... And I'm sitting there like, ooh, that's got to suck. And someone else comes in. They're looking for their phone. And so we're like, I'm like, all right. Just more people keep coming in. And I'm like, I just want to get back with my group. And so they go, they come. I'm like, all right. We're good. Like, not the people, but, like, the people, other people leave. Ah, my group doesn't come. And so we're like, all right. I'm like, all right. Ooh, whew, what are we going to do? So, she leaves, and this other guy comes in, and he works in Cedar Point Shores. I don't know what it's called anymore. It used to be called Soak City. And so, he comes on in, and I'm like, alright, he's in. And he starts he starts talking to me. He's like, hi, how are you? What's your name? I'm Mac. Drage. And talking, we're filling out stuff. And he's like, alright. Well, let's figure this out. And he's, we start brainstorming ideas, all sweet, super kind. And so, we all, we're all, like, alright. And so, they call, the guy who came out with, we're gonna call the, not, we're gonna call the officer to make sure that your people aren't there. He'll take you around, see where you were before. And so we did. He's like, so we. And I keep calling my mom through all this, like, hey, I'm over here, I'm over here, not with the group. And so, calling all these, my mom with all these numbers, and she's she's at home, like, who are all these people calling me? What do they want? She never answers. And so, we just, like, we're walking. We're walking. We, we walk towards um, where I got lost. And he's like, all right, let's look around, see if anyone you notice is standing around, looking around. No one's there. She's like, all right, we're going to take you to Lost Persons. No big deal. Just displaced. And so I head over there, and I'm in this room with all these, <laughs> like, no one's in there. It's just an empty room. And the people who did come in, they were right out, like, immediately. Like, they walked through the door. They're like, oh, no, your people are over there. Oh, good for you. You're gone. <laughs> so, yeah, I fall asleep. I wake up, and I hear my... Friend's mom shaking me on the shoulder like, Mac, wake up. And I'm like, oh, okay, so you're back. And so she's like, oh, thank goodness, I'm so sorry. I thought you were with the other group, and you, and they thought you were with my group. No one knew where you were. I'm sorry. And so we all went back to the car. It was time to go. I rode no other roller coasters. It's okay, though, because, like, I was tired and I probably wouldn't ride much more anyway. A little sad, though, you know, thinking that they didn't know where I was and thought I was with the other group and that the grandma knew where I was. Or she just forgot. But it's all right. We're okay. I'm in my home. I sent a peace of mind. If you've stayed this long for the video, thank you for watching. If you would like to look at my blog, that's in my About section. You can look at my blog. I comment. 
not comment, but I post on there every once in a while. So eventually, halfway through the video, if you've really watched it, you you did notice that seasons popped in later. I did bite in the middle of building this. Um, but thank you so much for staying, listening to me ramble about a Cedar Point story. If you would like to hear more stories, which I often don't have, but if you'd like to hear more, let me know in the comments down below. And all this other stuff, suggestions, stories, blah, blah, blah. I kind of ran out of time here. Like, I thought, oh my gosh, we're going to cut to the minute, cut to the T. We'll be perfect. Really? Wasn't? Like... I mean, the story was great, and I was interrupted. That's all right, too. Everything's okay. Everything's great. It's such a peace of mind. Um, so, I saw Incredibles 2. Not talking about it. Loved it. Also, um, like to see Mr. Rogers, because I, when I was real little, I would watch Mr. Rogers, and, like, every time I hear about him, I'm like, oh, <laughs> I miss him so much. And Daniel Tiger's not the same. Everyone's like, well, there's Daniel Tiger. I'm like, Daniel Tiger? Um... Daniel Tiger really is nothing. There's a difference. There's a difference. It's not the same guy. He's not. He's not in the same coat. I mean, he is. And everyone's like, I learned to tie my shoes from Daniel Tiger. Um, when did he tie shoes? Okay. So here are the screenshots. It's winter. Ah! <laughs> so this is back. This is actually my current household. So I decorated their house. Lovely. I love the living room and somewhat the kitchen, but the living room's the main part of the house. I love it. It's so great. And so, we got the upstairs, hallway, with all the decorations. We got the bathroom a little plain. Could have done more. Could have done more. Just was like more looking at the build items and building with them. The walls are plain. Could have put stuff on these dressers and stuff. The one room could use carpet. But I hope you all have a nice day. If you would like to look at the Sims 4 Cats and Dogs playlist, click at the top right. If you would like to subscribe, click at the bottom right. If you would like to see any of my other videos, click to the left. I hope you all have a nice day, and I will see you later. Bye.